Queries, like tables, are one of the objects of a database. A user can create and save a query in the same way that a user can create and save a table. We are going to look at the query CDs with a value of 100 Rand and less. I'm going to double click. It opens it, looks like a table. I'm going to make that narrow so I can see better. It has the field CD name, artist, genre, and replacement value. I can make that wider. Here we have it in alphabetical order according to the artist, not according to the CD name. It is artist. And if I look here, it's all the CDs that have a value of 100 Rand or less and there are 53 of them. I want to have a look at this query in design view. I'm going to view design view. Here I can see that this work, this query is based on the CD table. The field CD name, artist, genre, and replacement value have been used. The other fields, owner and contact details, have not been used in this query as they were not required. Notice here, under artist and sort, ascending has been selected. It's been sorted in ascending order. Note here, under replacement value, it is less than and equal to a hundred. Notice that the RAND sign is not there. So this query was based on the criteria less than or equal to a hundred RAND. And this is how a query is made. And then you run it. And then everything is extracted and is visible in a table.